now we are going to learn uh, the short answers of this lesson forgetting based on the understanding of the essay answer the following questions in one or two sentences each first one what does lind actually wonder at lind actually wonders at the efficiency of human memory name few things that a person remembers easily a person easily remembers telephone numbers addresses of his friends dates of a good vintage appointments of lunch and dinner names of actors actresses cricketers football players and murderers third one how do psychologists interpret forgetfulness psychologists say that people forget things because they want to forget them if we have aversion for something we forget it next one what's the commonest commonest type of forgetfulness according to lind according to robert lind the commonest type of forgetfulness is to post letters fifth one what does the author mean when he says the letter in his pocket leads an unadventurous life the letter is kept in the pocket and it is totally forgotten and it stays in the pocket for a long time till someone asks about the letter next what are the articles the author forgets most often books walking sticks and umbrella are the articles the author forgets most often next question who are the citizens of dreamland why the players are the citizens of dreamland after the game they think about what happened in the playground next question what is common about the angler and the poet the common thing about the angler and the poet is that they forget about their things it's because their mind is filled with some serious and glorious matters now we are going to learn the three more questions based on your reading answer the following questions in two to four, four sentences each what made people wonder about the absent mindedness of their fellow beings a list of articles lost by railway travelers was published when people read the list they wondered about the absent absent mindedness of their fellow beings the second question what are our memories filled with our memories are filled with the names of actors actresses cricketers football players and murderers moreover we remember the name of the hotel where we had an unpleasant meal and all the items of our dress normally we do not forget to shut the door when we leave the house next question when does human memory work with less than its usual capacity human memory works less than its usual capacity when it comes to the case of taking medicine it is easy to remember because medicine is connected to our food but we forget it many a time why according to lin should taking medicines be one of the easiest actions to remember taking medicine should be one of the easiest actions to remember medicine is supposed to be taken during before or after meal the meal itself should be a reminder for taking medicine the next question how do the chemists make fortunes out of the medicines people forget to take most of the people forget to take medicine because of this they will buy medicine again and again moreover their disease will not get cured without the medicine so they have to buy another set of medicine in this way chemists make their fortunes next question 
the list of articles lost in trains suggests that sportsmen have worse memories than their ordinary serious minded fellows why does lind say this when the sportsmen return from the games their imagination is still filled with the vision of the playing field they recall their exploits in their mind they are not connected with the outside world so they forget to take the ball and bat with them when they leave the train what kind of absent mindedness is considered as a virtue by lind the anglers and poets fill their mind with more glorious matters than the ordinary things such absent mindedness is considered a virtue they often make the best of their life so they do not remember the ordinary things the last question narrate the plight of the baby on its day out the baby was taken out in a perambulator by its father on his way home he wanted to get into a store so he left to the pram outside and he entered the store after finishing his work he came out through another door and went back home forgetting the child the mother happened to come that way and was shocked to see the abandoned baby she pushed the pram home thinking that the father would be worried about the missing baby but when he came home he asked her what she had for lunch he totally forget about the baby now we are going to learn the paragraph answers first one is given in the format of letter writing you have borrowed a branded cricket bat from your reluctant friend for an outsta- outstation match after returning home you realize you have absent mindedly left it in the hotel room write a letter of apology and regret to your friend now we are going to write it this is the personal letter this is the letter you are writing to your friend 27 netaji road nagarkoil 7th august 2020 Dear Raju thank you so much for having given me your cricket bat i played well with your bat and i am sure your bat was a lucky bat to me as you know we won the match and my contribution was great after the prize distribution we went to our hotel room and took rest for, uh, took rest for some time Then we were talking about our exploits and we were enjoying ourselves. We packed everything and were waiting for our cab to take us to the railway station. Within a short time the cab came and we all ran happily to get our places. In the cab also we were talking about the match. When I got into the train it started moving. Then I realized my blunder. I forgot to pick up your bat from the hotel room. Immediately I tried to contact the manager and told him about this. He promised me to help. I really feel sorry for this. I know how much you love that bat and you gave it to me just to help me. I hope we will get back the bat. I request you to forgive me for this. when i reach your our village i will meet you sorry for the trouble i have created your loving friend silva the next question khalil gibron states forgetfulness is a form of freedom write an article for your school magazine linking your ideas logically and giving appropriate examples first we have to write the title of the lesson then the name of the author then we have to give the theme so title forgetting author robert lin then theme forgetfulness as a form of freedom a man who is a perfect remembering machine 
is seldom a man of the first intelligence forgetfulness is a form of freedom it may sound little funny because we curse ourselves if we forget something good memory power is always appreciated in the period of our study we always want to remember what we learn we feel sorry if we forget our lessons in the exam hall but in many other cases forgetfulness is a blessing certain unpleasant experience in our memory will be a thorn to us it will be pricking us all the time if we forget that we will be free of that unpleasant experience such a situation occurs very often in our life it may be a failure in our life and this will be spoiling our happiness it will be a block for further positive thinking some family may lose one of the members and it will be a trying experience for the whole family they cannot go on living with that sad experience throughout their life slowly they will be free of that sad feeling loss of a job will also give some problem but when we forget this we will be free to search for a job we might land up in a better job so gibron is right in saying forgetting is a form of freedom the advantage of a bad memory is that one enjoys several times the same good things for the first time the next question will you sympathize or ridicule someone who is intensely forgetful write an essay justifying your point the people who forget very often are normally ridiculed because they lose many opportunities in life to grow in public life they are not treated well even in his family others will not have confidence in him he may not be interested with any serious work in some cases highly intelligent people who have some great ideas in their mind forget trivial things the trivial things may affect the family for example a wife enters on her husband to pay the electricity bill on the last day but he comes back home without paying the bill he must have been thinking about something great in his mind but the family will suffer because of his forgetfulness in such cases the family people should have good understanding of the person and they should not depend on him for doing such things like paying electricity or telephone bill here a question arises whether such people should be sympathized with or ridiculed if his forgetfulness is due to the preoccupied mind it is a case to be sympathized but with but if it is a habit it is a case to be ridiculed thank you thank you students